Blue Origin just announced something that could completely change the future of private spaceflight and upgrade to their new Glenn rocket so big. It moves the rocket into the Super Heavylift class. After finally achieving its first orbital mission with a recoverable booster, Jeff Bezos' company is now planning to scale New Glenn far beyond its original design. Why? Because SpaceX's Starship changed the game and Blue Origin knows and must respond. The current New Glenn can lift about 45 tons to low Earth orbit, but the upgraded version internally called 94 will boost that to 70 tons. That's a massive jump achieved by increasing the first stage from 7 to 9 BE for engines, and doubling the second stage from 2 to 4 BE 3U engines. The rocket's fairing will also grow to 8.7 meters in diameter, giving it a more payload volume than the existing new Glenn. And Blue Origin says the upgraded rocket will be able to send more than 20 tons on a trajectory toward the moon. All of this sounds impressive, but here's the catch. Unlike SpaceX's fully reusable Starship, New Glenn's upper stage is still expendable and built from aluminum, not stainless steel. So even in the super heavy category, it won't match Starship's re Industry sources say Blue Origin is targeting a first flight of the larger New Glenn around 2027. Extremely ambitious, considering the company reached orbit for the first time only in 2025, 25 years after it was founded. So what's the goal? Blue Origin says the bigger rocket will support mega constellations, lunar missions, deep space flights, and U.S. military programs, including potential launches of the Orion spacecraft as an alternative to NASA's extremely expensive SLS. But the big question remains, can Blue Origin actually compete with SpaceX without a fully reusable second stage? Or is this rocket aimed mainly at government contracts instead of the commercial market?